What's going on? It's Sergio Toast, and I am very, very excited for this Brilliant Stars Sword and Shield. Uh, I don't know everything that's in here, and that's kind of the whole uh, surprise about it, because I know that there's Charizard, obviously. I know that there is Arceus. Uh, there's a few that I know that are in here. Shaman. Um, I know that there's a special bronze zone that caught my attention. And I know that there's a lot of, like, special arts in here. I don't know the actual full list, but I know a few of the nices. I know that there's Urshifus, and I really, really like that they put a lot of, uh, special arts. I feel like they're not going to do that for every set. So I feel like... This set's going to be a lot of money. And I feel like it's going to be a really successful set. I'm not even sure if every set is successful. I'm pretty sure it's Pokemon. It's so hard to find. But I think this will be very hard to find. Um, I mean, very successful. I'm pretty sure they're still going to be hard to find. But this one I had to pay extra five bucks for because I forgot to pre-order it. So I had to go and get it at another spot. But at least the other spot has it. And it's only extra five bucks versus... 10 20 but this comes with we have a 40 set a 40 ready to play deck including one of four unique foil cards and it comes with four packs i think that kind of sucks but um pink dirty kind of is trash um and then it comes with a card but i needed to go and get it because you know i i'm a pokey addict so I need my pokey fix. So here we go. We're gonna open this thing. Whenever this opens. But I wonder how V Star is gonna change the meta, you know? Because I think we're gonna phase out um V Maxes soon and go to V Stars. Or maybe V uh V uh, stars will be the more powerful. Then, uh, V Maxes. We'll see. I like in the clip. Okay, let's see who our first card is. Leopard, Lightpart. Lightpart, it's foil. Let's just see these cards. They're not really the thing to see, but they're kind of hard to open today. Jeez. But I don't think anything in here is going to be crazy. Oh, these lands are nice. Why did I say lands? Energy. Are these the new energy of the year? Because I am liking these a lot more. Ooh. Okay, so it's just basic stuff. I think that was the only thing that like popped up for me. Oh, and there's a full set of, uh, not the full set, but we have the whole evolution line of Chimchar, uh, Monferno, and Infernape. I'm going to read very quick to see if they're good. Burning kick this card all of this energy from this card. Eh. I do like, uh, the Cinderace that has, um single strike and it's just a um not a v or v max i like those okay but those lands i mean sorry i have magic on my mind those basic lands those basic energy geez are very very nice and we have the through four packs comes with four packs um obviously we want the charizard but um, I'm not even sure where prices are at. And I'm not even sure what's fully in the set. So, I mean, I would be happy with the Bronzong. Uh, I I know like they have a little trainer with them. And then they have that. Or Sylveon. Like Sylveon. Or Urshifu. Here's pack one. There's already something back there, I feel. The Denny, my boy! I 
miss you the dead end standard. I like it. Oh, and they're guard chop. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. And look at these. Look at these. I love these. I'm going to be switching my decks with those for sure. I need some water energy because my main deck, uh, at least for um, powerful and as powerful as I want to without uh, having the same thing as other people, is uh, Ice Rider Calyrex. But I do want to have those medals for, you know, my best bird. All right, let's see what we got here. Uh, we don't got nothing. But that the den is looking nice. The den flash. The day flash. Yeah, he looks so happy. If your opponent has one, exactly one prize card remaining, this attack does 60 more damage and your opponent active Pokemon is now confused. I mean, attack sucks, but the art is so cool. It's gonna get saved. Okay. Let's see. Nothing. Oh, and I feel like this magma bit basin. I feel like, well, let me just say this. I feel like um, for the people that actually care about TCG, fire is definitely going to get a, a boost. It was like one of the best before the rotation last year. And now it's like the worst. And now it's probably going to be mid. Here's the last pack. The last pack, right? Last pack. Let's give it a little rub. Shaman, you're gonna show up. Uh, there might be something back there. What is this? A V-Star token. Yeah, this was bad. Uh, but we did get the Kindler. Which I said, uh, fire is going to get a boost and that's what's going to boost it. But these, I guess they're pretty cool that they include with these. Because I know with the the tag teams, they didn't have them in their pack. So, I guess that works. But, um, talking about tag teams, V-Stars are definitely going to replace them. And, well, they're already gone, the, v, the tag teams. But, I feel like... They're not going to be as powerful as tag teams because I feel like they know that they made a mistake. So I feel like when all the ones that I did see, they look okay. They don't look anything crazy, but yeah. Um, the Denny was the star. He was the first pack I opened. And uh, that's what it is. And um, when release comes out, I'm going to buy some packs. I'm going to buy some... I'm going to buy a... Um, Elite Trainer Box, and I can't wait for it because I feel like this is going to do well. I'm telling you. I feel like um, it's going to switch uh, the meta, like I said. So we're going to see uh, good decks um, from this set, and we're going to see a lot of change. So I'm uh, excited for the New Year of Pokemon. Uh, I'm excited for TCG Live whenever that comes. I know there's a beta in Canada, but I'm not in Canada. They should have done North America. But anyways, I will see you in the next video.